Hi everyone, as you know, Hello Fire is shutting down. So we have provided a legacy support and I will be taking you through how to withdraw on each of these platforms. First off, we start with Minipay. You can go to the site tester session and withdraw from Mola. Mola is a platform that HelloFi uses to generate yield. To withdraw from Mola, you need to go to the website app.mola.market and once you search this on the site tester, you would be able to connect your wallet and after connecting your wallet, you would find your funds where you can also withdraw. Withdrawing is quite easy. You just need to click on withdraw and input the amount you want to withdraw and confirm the transaction and your CUSD would be sent directly to your Minipay wallet. After a successful withdrawal, your account would be empty on the Mula market and you can go to HelloFi to check if your funds have been withdrawn and you will find out that your balance has been withdrawn from HelloFi and that is how you withdraw from Minipay using Mola market. Now let's proceed to withdrawing from the Mola market website in case you have used a wallet to save on HelloFi. So the same process, you connect your wallet, you click on withdraw, input the amount you want to withdraw, click on next and um, confirm the transaction. Once you confirm the transaction in your wallet, the CUSD would be moved from Mola market to your wallet and you can find your balance in your wallet as easy as that please let us know if you have any questions in the course of withdrawal and here you can also check the transaction on cello explorer and that's how you withdraw your cusd from molar market now let's proceed to withdrawing from bfi this is for those who have saved usdc on base you need to connect your wallet click on my position and click on base and you are going to see your balance on base you click on withdraw click on usdc and impute the amount you want to withdraw we advise you to withdraw all of your assets you click on withdraw and then you confirm the transaction as easy as that and once you confirm the transaction, the funds are moved into your wallet. That's how to withdraw from bfi.com. Next off, we provided an alternative to withdraw from Basecan. And you just need to click on the transaction ID, click on contract, write as prosy, connect your wallet, and then click on withdraw. And once you click on withdraw all, number 16, you click on confirm and your funds get withdrawn immediately you can view the transaction on basecan to confirm that your withdrawal was successful and these are two different ways to withdraw your usdc on base network via bfi and basecan if you save your usdc via the avi pool you need to go to the avi website connect your wallet and make sure you're on the base network once you're on the base network you just need to click on withdraw and put the amount you want to withdraw you can withdraw all of your funds and all you need to do is click on withdraw usdc once you confirm the transaction on your wallet the withdrawal process would be initiated and you would have your funds in your wallet in no time as you can see in this video to demonstrate that this withdrawal is in real time, we refresh on this example and you can see that the transaction has been initiated. We can then proceed to withdraw all of the USDC on our wallet. Another way to do this is via the base can. You click on the transaction ID, click on contract and you click on write as proxy. You can then connect your wallet to the wallet you want to withdraw funds from. Once you do that, you want to head down to withdraw number 41. Here, you are required to paste 
the USDC contract address on base so you can get this on base can and paste you move ahead and include the amount you want to withdraw there is a tool to help you include that the right way once you've done that you're also going to include the wallet address where you want the funds to be withdrawn to and all you need to do next is to click on write once you click on write you will need to confirm the transaction and after that the withdrawal will be completed you can click on view your transaction to find the details of the transaction and just how you withdraw from base can apart from withdrawing from mola you can also withdraw from cello scan and you need to click on the contract id click on contract connect your wallet and scroll down to withdraw here you need to put the asset address which is the cusd contract address on cello you can easily get that on cello scan you can include the amount you want to withdraw say for instance 0.01 cusd once you do this you need to include more zeros 18 to be precise so to do this you can use the tool that has been provided by clicking on the plus and selecting 10 raised to power 18. once you're done with this you can then add the wallet address you want to withdraw to which is your wallet address once you add this you can click on write and your funds will be withdrawn to your wallet after clicking on write you have to confirm the transaction and after confirming you can view the transaction details to confirm that your funds have indeed been withdrawn do reach out to us if you have any question